hashtag CCINEJC CCM host for the Facebook groups. I don't know how far and wide I'm gonna post this one, but I'm gonna try. I'll, I'll try and put it up into into a few groups. Um, I'm gonna do a little bit of a review of the Temple RDA by VaporsCloud.com. VaporsZCloud.com. Um, can't show you the airflow because I'm not allowed, so I'm not gonna do it. Um, but I've got a question. While I drink coffee at nine something, at uh, you know o'clock at night, um, if a man were to walk up to you on the street, you've never met him before, you have no idea who he is, but he offers you a pill to give you the power of God. Would you take it, and why? Leave your answer in the comments below. I'd love to see if you can answer it correctly. Okay? Got dog hair everywhere. Dog loves me. Anyway, what we got going on here is a 8 wrap, 18 gauge Dragon Wars. Okay? With, uh, we're going to be vaping on some Finley's number 6. Um,. I don't have a, a shit ton of wick in here. I just have enough wick to uh, wet down so that, you know, the coils are, are good and saturated. And then um, I don't really have any on the deck because I don't need it. I was able... I was able to put enough wick in here that I could juice up effectively. And get, like... Uh, four good inhales off of it. It's pretty sweet. I'm using, uh, I said 8 wrap, 18 gauge Dragon Water, okay, on a 5 30 seconds bit. It ohms out to 0 0.11 some odd. It fluctuates between 1 and 5. I don't know why. I get a weird voltage drop through this RDA. A couple other RDAs i found do this can't name them off the top of my head right now, but there are a couple, well, I think the Mutation X V2 does it, to be honest. Other ones too, I don't, I don't know. But, this build is firing at 5.5 uh, volts right now. And I can actually hold the button for a full second of a pulse without burning the cotton. I like that because before I could only pulse it for just a, of a, just a smidgen before it would uh, start burning the cotton. The airflow on this thing is top notch. Mr. Tran did an, a, an impeccable job with the airflow. Okay, an impeccable job. I'm going to be utilizing uh, a pyramid. Okay. That's all I'm going to say about it. I think there's like... I don't know. A triangle? It's more like a triangle. I'm going to be utilizing uh, four, seven, ten. Ten holes. Okay, Finley's number six. I'll show you what I got going on here. I really like this wire, and I really like the flavor that this RDA gives me. It puts out a really, really, really nice cloud. I can take a stiff inhale and still get all of the flavor and, and all the, like the tightness that I want. Mr. Lore was talking about tightness about three months ago, telling me that he got that tightness back. Uh, I can't I can't remember the mod he was talking about. I think it was a lipo. Um, I'd forgotten what this feels like. Okay. I really had, and I got it. I got it back. It's something about how the airflow works. Okay, again, Mr. Tran, impeccable work, sir. This, in, 
in my semi-professional opinion, okay, this is the best RDA on the market right now for doing what I'm doing with uh, this, R this 18 gauge. What, what a, a 30 millimeter? This is the best 30 millimeter uh, RDA on the market, hands down. There's nothing, I haven't encountered anything better. And I've used a lot of 30 millimeter RDAs. Stellaire, I've got four Cerberuses, one authentic Cerberus and three clones. I've got, uh, you know, the, the Tobe, um, you know. I've got three Zephyr Buddhas, two custom and, and a normal one. And I've got a uh, Buddha V1, and then I got a uh, two, I got two glaciers. Thank you, Mr. Tran. Um, this thing is retarded. Awesome, okay? It gives me a lot of control. A lot of control. At first I didn't like the airflow, but then I baked on it. And I got I kind of got used to it. Which is hard to explain because it's it's counterintuitive. At least it was for me. Like I'm used to haphazardly centering my builds and you don't need to do that at all. It's actually better to build on one side of this deck. It's, it's awesome because I hate centering my builds. It's so annoying and it doesn't matter. And with this RDA, it really doesn't matter. I mean, you actually profit from having it off center. When this thing goes live, okay, and everybody is able to experience this, you're going to know what I'm talking about. If you're trying to skirt that, that knife edge, okay, if you're, if you're trying to run across like a, a samurai sword, like a katana, okay, a sharp katana, this, this is the RDA for you if, if that's what you're trying to do. It really, really does feel good to blow clouds with this thing. And from the density of the vapor that stays after I blow the cloud, I'm impressed. I, I mean, I really am impressed with this. I think I might be able to go farther with this RDA. I actually think I can. I'm not, you know, totally positive. There's a lot of a lot of different factors in going past 10 feet. Most people say they can, you know, mo most people say they can go 8 feet, okay? But to get past 8 feet, it's really really hard. And to get to 10 feet consistently is really really hard. I I know I'm just an arrogant asshole and my videos are whack, but with witnesses I was able to get 12 foot continuous from one side of a room to another with force. And I lost it. I wasn't able to do it again. after I did it three times in a row. Um, I think this RDA might allow me to do that with a little bit of tweaking. I, I think it's a winner. I really, really do. I, I, I mean, it's it's really hard to explain how excited I am to play with this RDA. The flavor is impeccable. You know, it's, it's odd to say that. A lot of people don't understand the kind of flavor you get off of heat, off of this kind of heat. A lot of people say they vape 18 gauge all day long. They do this, they do that. I've run two sets of batteries through this mod today. This is the, the third set, and I'm already down to five, uh, well, it's firing at 5.5 uh, volts, you know? It started off at uh, 5.7 volts.
which is kind of interesting. Oh, there's, there's still another cloud in there. The amount of wicking I was able to put inside these coils is awesome. I've never had, uh, or I've never built coils at 5.30 seconds before. And I'm liking it. I'm liking what I'm able to do with them. Okay? It's a lot of fun. Uh, a lot of fun. You know? Thank you, Mr. Lore. Number six is awesome. It's really delicious. Like, I mean, where are you, where are you going to be able to puke out guava? It's not a replacement for Joker, but it is really, really good. At first, I never liked these large chuck caps, but for this RDA, again, it works absolutely flawless. I'm really, really liking what it's able to do and how well it performs. I mean, I, I can't say enough about it. I really can't. <clears throat> the Temple RDA by VaporsCloud.com. VaporsZCloud.com. When it goes live, if you're searching for a 30 millimeter RDA, that is going to look clean on your on your mod if you're using a tube mod or a stacked or something like that um, or a box mod like this and you're going to be running you know some bigger coils or you're going to be doing your your you know your your different coils and stuff like that the the different twists and braids and, and stuff I, I don't worry about that crap I just go up a gauge because that's it's it's way easier to to wrap um, especially this dragon wire once it becomes available Bradley Crane is someone you want to contact on Facebook. Um, you know, or annoy Kratos, try and get the supply chain going. I, I don't know. He's working on it. He's working on it. Um, really, really, really impressive. What I did for the coils, okay, I couldn't get them to stop hot spotting in the same hole. So I've got one coil in the bottom set. This is a dual post quad hole uh, design. I've got one coil with the leads up. Um, on one side, I'll say the right side, my right. Then I've got the other side set of coils uh, positioned down with the leads. So it gives me an act, it's, it's actually perfectly aligned. It's, it's a pretty cool design. I thought about it and, you know, it works flawlessly. It, it really does. I really, really like it. It was, it's surprising. It's surprising. I apologize for not using this RDA once it, it came to me. I was on a, a tube kick trying to relearn how to inhale, exhale with a tube. And my journey back into tubes brought me to this. And it's helped me think about it. You know, try and, try and get to, to that farther step. It's hard, it's hard to explain. Once you've been somewhere, and all you want to do is go back, that's uh, that's the trick. You know what I'm saying? I hope you all enjoyed the video. I had fun making it. The Temple RDA by VaporsCloud.com. Pay attention to the website. You need one of these. If you're running a box like me, if you're trying to build something crazy and you want to get the perfect airflow, you know what I'm saying? Again, I can't show you the airflow and I can't <coughs> comment any more than that, but take it from a retard cloud chaser. Best RDA I've used in a long, long time. Okay, hands down. This is a, a Zephyr Buddha killer. There's there's no two ways around it. 
if you got a Zephyr Buddha, a lot of them, I know a couple guys have a lot of them, I'm sorry, you need this. This will impress you. Mr. Tran, you're doing a great job, sir. Absolutely impeccable work. It's amazing what you were able to come up with. And I can't wait to see what else you come up with. Okay? Two thumbs up, sir. You're doing a great job. Hashtag shots fired. Clouds down.